Hello everybody, my name is Avyman117, also known as Simon, and I'm here with the Gaming Temptations crew to do a nice, chilled out, sort of mellow underwater survival map. And I'm here with Lighty and Jens. Please Hello. introduce yourselves. Yep, there you go. <laughs> and uh, yeah, we really just sort of don't know. Um, we're still getting used to the whole group recording thing, so uh, bear with us. We are just a little bit, eh, it's the middle of the night for Lighty and I, or close to it. And we're just pretty much chilling out. That's all, uh, that's all we're going to do. So we've gone and built this nice little uh, dome. Actually, Jens did fantastic work. Uh, we've built a little bedroom over that way, and we're just going to do a nice underwater survival. Really simple. Survival build. Survival. Yeah, survival build. Everything we do is going to be legit. The only things that aren't legit are the rooms we've built so far, because we need the resources for that, and that takes ages, and pretty much everything in this chest. But apart from that, everything is legit. Nobody saw also that. a side note, um, this world here is not a standard vanilla Minecraft world. The entire world is actually one big ocean, so there's nothing like, oh well, we want to go up to land and get some resources. Yeah, nope. so we it are completely cut off from anything. We're actually in a miscraft world. We can't travel back to the um, main world because someone, me, forgot to bring a linking book, so we're pretty much stranded here. We literally have to survive on our own here. There's absolutely nothing we can do. Apart from creative mode or spawning things in, we can't cheat. But by the way, guys, apparently my dog wants to play Minecraft. <laughs> oh yeah, dogs <laughs> do that all the time. <laughs> oh, well, for... shall we get started? I we probably we should. Get... We probably should get uh, started. Simon, you 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 can expect the uh, chest to show everybody what we have given ourselves. I to have actually with. did that, but I didn't look at it a lot. All we have here is six apples, one of each sapling. Uh, we do have a rubber sapling. Fantastic. Um, I would we have... are playing Feed the Beast. Yeah, we are playing yeah. Feed the Beast, so we have to do that. Um, we have some sugar canes, one bone, two cow eggs, because there are no animals here, and six eggs. So, hopefully one of those drops a chicken, at least. Hopefully. Um, that actually works out quite nice. We can give ourselves two eggs each and just hope to God. <laughs> yeah. I think we've done a little bit of um, enough explanation, so we should probably just get right into it. Once again, this is going to be a very laid-back... Uh, series so it's not going to be super uh, exciting it's just going to be we're going to enjoy ourselves you guys will hopefully enjoy it and maybe we'll talk about some interesting things along the way so anyway let's get started shall we we just get some ideas really yeah pretty okay. much oh by okay. the way um so sorry to cut you off there laddie if at any point during this series you have an idea of something which would be cool to see uh feel free to put it in the comments we'll see what we can do Obviously, since we're not doing a creative build, some things are limited to us um, initially, but we will get around to anything that we think is a good idea. Carry on, light. Hope to God that we're going to get some seeds. <laughs> yeah, we have to get seeds, otherwise we're screwed. In which case, if we don't get seeds, we have to go around and hunt some skeletons underground and uh, get some bones. Because if we don't, we are kind of boned. Alright, guys. Farm, seed, farm seed. seeds! Seeds! Yes, we got One seeds. is all we need for now. Right. Let, let, let's keep the flowers just because they look pretty. Yeah, hold on. Let's uh, kill this this one here, and this one here, and this one here, and we'll keep them, but we won't have them on the ground because they're blocking our path. <gasps> How dare you! <laughs> We've got two pieces of bone meal left. Yes. Yep. Ah, save them for now. I hate having to mess um, with my settings, but hey, I do. How do I get okay. more FPS? Do, do, do. So I'm guessing to start with we should actually start making some food, yeah? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, we should probably get some food else um, we're going to be in trouble. Okay, well how about... What about trees? We need we need uh, wood. We need wood to start out with. I, I wouldn't mind through that if I were you. Well, we need water for the uh, farm, dude. Do we have a bucket? That is true. We, we don't need a bucket, we can just break the wall. That is true. Well, <laughs> I'd God, say you know, I don't be... Yeah, simplicity. That's the whole nature of this uh, survival build. Everything should just be simple. It doesn't need to be overcomplicated. Uh, we just need the oak tree for now, man. You know, thank God for Minecraft physics. If this was real life physics, we would be dead. Oh my God, yes. Actually, no. Uh, if my so understanding of air pressure is correct, we would probably... Uh, the water would only be up to around this level where my head is right here. Yeah, and the rest true. of it would be fine. Hey, look at me, look at me, look at me, I have smell affairs, look at me! You are one weird person. 
Yeah, so you guys do that. I'm going to do a... Much. I'm going to do a bit of a uh, quick Simon FPS test. Apples. apples. Yeah, I'm cool. <laughs> I'm cool. But I'll take them anyway. Yes. Simon was mean to me. <laughs> I, I don't even. Oh, what exactly was he? Me too. <laughs> Point weird. out on the doll where he touched you. Oh. I don't think yeah. I can point at the soul on a uh, doll. You disgust me, dude. Yeah. So uh, the frame rate in the water is okay. It's not the greatest, but hey, it works. Just to prove to everyone who was watching, because I'm the only recorder at the moment, this is it. There is nothing. There is just ocean, uh, a stone platform. And this. So really, there is nothing. We're not lying to you. There is no land. Everything we do pretty much has to be underwater or underground. Mostly underwater, because overground is so passe. I mean underground. Also, I don't think you want to go above ground unless you want to um, spontaneously combust. Yes. Um, uh. This world has a very strange, uh, very strange effect, and it probably gives us reason to stay underwater. If you actually go um, above the water, you actually get slowness on you. The slowness debuff, I believe, was it? Or is it and something else? There's a small chance you may catch on fire, so... We'll, oh. We're in water, so it's really not a uh, big issue. That is true. That's true. Uh, probably not get rid of so many torches, because mobs will actually start spawning here, because uh, they have nowhere else to spawn. Uh, that is true. <laughs> this is true, yeah. We have to make sure everything we do is well lit. And all that. So we also need a place to start mining. And, oh, you know what we forgot to actually spawn ourselves in? Pickaxes. We don't need pickaxes. We can make them. Dude, we'll just make them. Oh, okay, it's fine. God, you're lazy. Yeah, I know, I know. <laughs> no I'm lazy. Everybody. Simon is the lazy one. Oh, I am. Right. Have you seen my new food. channel oh, art? My it's channel cool. art is just like the laziest thing ever. Oh. All right, so, save that last bone meal, dude. Question is, can we yeah. put, like, another bit of... Can we put another tree where I'm standing, or will it not have room with the dome? Ah, uh, it depends on what type of tree, yeah. I believe. This is why I prefer, um, spruce trees, I think they are, because they are the most tame trees ever. Sure, the height varies, but they're never too fat. Like, Well, a spruce tree wouldn't have enough space in here, to be honest. A spruce. It's basically oh, a yeah, tree. Of course, they would uh, actually punch through the ceiling, and we wouldn't exactly want that to happen now, would we? Well, it wouldn't actually grow, you see. That's that wouldn't yeah. exactly be optimal, would it, Jens? Yep. Oh, that isn't exactly optimal. Mm. Let's hope we get some saplings. I got one. Oh, nice. Woo, we got saplings. How many, though? Okay, we, we have a crafting table now. Beautiful. Alright, so the first thing I think we'll need is actually a pickaxe, because we need stone. Yeah, so I was actually going to do all like the uh, gardening here and stuff, but since we're not going to be getting to that probably any time soon, I will probably grab myself a pickaxe as well and start mining. Question uh, is, where? Uh, yes? Is it yes? just me, or is the water acting... Um, no, weird? that's uh, it does that. It's just the way... <laughs> yeah, it's, it's gravity defined. It's only because there's water on the other end of that corner. I plant the seed. That did not sound dirty at all. It's not meant to. I swear. Okay then. Do you think <laughs> this uh, sugarcane has enough light to grow? Uh, oh, it should have. Yeah, should do. Okay, where am I? Where am I putting our mine to start with? Oh, well, I was thinking that I think actually, actually, um, I was thinking <clears throat> a little room off here. Like, we make a little uh, stone uh, stairwell down from one of, like from here, but uh, since that's going to take some stone and we don't have stone, we should probably just dig it somewhere in the dome. And that rhymes. I don't know if I stone think we dome. should dig it inside our <laughs> garden. Well, we, you can always fill the garden back up, I guess. Yeah, it's true. You can well, always fill true, the hole in. But I don't exactly want the mine access inside here. That wouldn't exactly be... Um... Not we optimal, are going to need lots more wood because we're going to need to burn it for charcoal so we can make torches. We're also going to need a well, furnace. Well, that means we'll need to place the monsters can spawn, so... Oh, oh uh, by the God. way, Damn it. Uh, have this leftover wood, but don't use it to make pickaxes. Pickaxes. Oh, I'll pick make hackers. some stone ones. Yes. I'm very good with my words. Herp derp words. Herp derp tar cloud. <laughs> I'm good with words, bud. Dude. Well, we'll see. 
But I still don't agree with the with this like um, non. I don't, I don't know how to explain that. You don't agree with uh, with this hole we're digging in the dome? Yeah, pretty much. Pretty okay, much. that's there's nothing wrong with that. Now I would like to ask you a question. Do you have an alternative? Mm, I actually think like a hole, maybe down here, like a um, stair or something. Yeah, if we absolutely are going. To I was thinking here. we build stairs down out of this hallway, so it's just like uh, one of the doors in the hallway. Yeah, that is like more. But we don't have the stone to actually do it, so we'll uh, do that once we have the stone for it. Until then, this hole will have to suffice. Uh, yeah, so this is just a temporal hole, right? Yes, this is just a temporal hole in space and time. Yeah, I got stone pickaxe. <laughs> uh, stone tools like a block. That that one's for one of you guys. I didn't I, have enough stone to make another one. That's cool. I'll give you a hand then. Uh, make a room first, guys, so skeletons can actually spawn. We do need the bone meal. Okay, we'll make a room. We're not gonna survive if oh, that bone meal. Man. We got green stuff. Yeah, I'm so glad this world actually has ores. You know, originally we didn't think it did have ores, and then Jens decided he'd drop a nuke. And uh, we noticed that it had ores around the fringe of the nuke, so that's how we figured it out. Yes, yes, trustful Yens, after we told him not to use a nuke, used a nuke. He made a nice natural crater for us to explore, and it's really pretty to look at. I'm guessing that we can't destroy these ores yet. Apparently no. I just got hurt by something. That would probably be the quartz crystal. Uh, you need an iron pickaxe for that ore. Yeah. I don't want to like iron pickaxe. Well, not emeralds. Um, it's called green sapphires. Which makes so, no sense to me. It's but. basically emeralds. Yes. Yeah, basically emeralds, but they had to be renamed since yeah, the original vanilla Minecraft introduced emeralds. Yeah, you know, something funny about that. I've noticed that a lot of stuff from a couple of really cool mods get added to Minecraft. And a lot of the times, I don't think that the mod creators actually get given credit. Like, I think no. they just take the mods. Well, it's like, uh, what is it? There's a whole heap of other games that do that sort of thing, too. It's like, um, I know Dungeon Defenders, for anybody who's familiar with that game, they're basically open online system, allows people to use Steam Workshop to make their own maps and that. And then they hold a competition, and basically the winner of the competition gets their map put onto the actual game. The thing is, when you have newcomers coming into the game, they tend to not actually know who created the maps. And yeah, so the actual creators just that don't. is actually true. Yeah, the actual actually, creators. Actually, the way Minecraft know. works is possible. Where it's a like on-demand thing, so a lot of players would like demand this to be added to the game from this yeah. mod, and the Minecraft um, devs would actually add it. Do you Again, know I'm not um, exactly sure about this, but hey. as far as I've heard, it's how it works. Do you know how many times I've actually seen a? Uh, a game, and I thought, wouldn't it be cool if I could, I could experience this in Minecraft and then looked for a mod of it, and it just doesn't exist? Anyway, yes, Lighty? Mm, that ass. I mean... <sighs> I'm gonna go build us a furnace. Uh, we also need a saw if we need that bone meal. I didn't say anything. Lies, you did. Okay, I'm gonna build us three furnaces, because three is a nice number. Anyone got that oak sapling? Uh, I'd ha I have it. Peekaboo! I see you! Can I have it? <laughs> Can you. I have sapling? Can I have yep. your sapling? Mm. That's what she said. Oh, come on, Lighty, really? Is it because <laughs> you're tired or is it because you're just that silly all the time? A bit of bows, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Give us your dirt. Mmm. The cool thing is we uh, discussed some really interesting things and uh, just having a sort of mellowed out recording session with some survival might actually yield some interesting conversations, so... Uh, well, just why not? <laughs> mm. And considering that most of these videos that we do actually do, which I don't think people quite understand, me and Simon tend to actually record in video when it's about 1 o'clock in the morning Put for the us. light back. We don't need no light. Come here, you sexy bitch. No, no, Come no, here. no, Jeff no, no, how could you do this to me? How could you do this to me? How could I you? I have a crystal for your buttocks. No. <laughs> Take that. <No. laughs> okay. Okay. Come to the edge. Come to the edge. 
come to the edge. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll let you out. Sorry, uh, Jens, that was just um, some lag. No, seriously, though, put the uh, light back or I'm stealing one. All right, all right. I'm just not sure if I want to go down where there with the light at the moment. It's a bit dangerous, you know. Just it. We can't even just be mildly serious, can we? Oh, and not only... Oh, I was going to say, not only have you... um. Bring the light. Torchbearer, come! And let there be light. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously? I'm a well, happy person! <laughs> For some reason, I think my character suits me. I think it does. <laughs> I love how we just all of a sudden we went quiet whilst we were mining. Yeah, I tend to just do that. Mining's a sort of relaxing experience for me. As long as I'm just hollowing out an area for no particular reason. I find killing people relaxing. Nice. I'm just gonna go up <laughs> here slow <laughs> and steadily. Please tell me somebody else heard that background music. Yeah, I heard yeah. it. <laughs> that was just <laughs> perfect. Oh. Timing. Also, seems like we now got some wood. Woo! Well, Jens has wood, everybody. <laughs> Look here. Oh my goodness. <sighs> Immature humor. It's the best type. Please don't tell me you're gonna turn into another vid, eh? Oh, no. At least I don't grief. Much. Oh, if, only had, much. Like, a, if only had like a face camera. I was just pulling off the seediest smile you would ever see. <laughs> yeah, face cameras might be something we'll do in the future, who knows. Hmm. Oh, speaking of which, who has that bone? The bone meal, the bone, the bone, the bone. Of meal. The bone meal. Well, you had I it got last, didn't you? Oh, yeah. I no, got it late, yes. yes. Jesus. Chuck it to me, I want to get more seeds. Uh, are you guys okay with me using cobblestone for construction, or would you rather I smelt it first? Um, I think you should just use cobblestone to start out with. We are pretty, well, low on resources. <laughs> yeah, cobblestone's our sort of cheap building material. Yeah. Alright, guys. Just uh, go down get up. Yeah, just up. be warned, there is a little bit of, um, water in the tunnel. Go away, squid. No one likes you. I, um, opened the tunnel up so I could create a mineshaft entrance. <sighs> It's actually Rookie. a good thing Minecraft doesn't have dynamic, um, water. If this was Terraria, we'd like... be dead. Yeah, pretty much. Quick! Shut the airlock, so no water can get ahead. <laughs> I'll the airlock. Of bio, okay. the airlock of a wooden door. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> this is some high-tech stuff, man. Oh my god, I cannot comprehend this high-tech technology. Water's fixed. <laughs> yeah. Uh, lock open. Um, could I borrow someone's pickaxe for like one block? Could you hit that bottom block? There. Like that bottom cobblestone block. Thank you. Okay, now we just dig a hole down. Really simple. Mm. And then we put a door there, and we have a, um... We have a mine which isn't in our dome, so that would be good. I actually think we may need to expand and build more biodomes, actually, like a pure forest biodome, for instance. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Oh. We're going to be doing that, of course. Um, but, you know, uh, how much glass is in here and how much stone and how much time and effort and how much water you have to clear, it'll take a while. Yeah, yeah we'll need diving suits, that's for sure. Yeah. Speaking of which, I need to eat... Right, Perhaps we should, again, man. maybe we should just set our um, spawns here, so in case we die, we're good. I'm just going to turn it to night for like a second, just so I can sleep. Let me Whoa. sleep. All right, sleep Let time. me sleep. Oh, fine, I'll turn it to midnight. It is midnight, and it says you can only sleep at night. This is a miscraft world. Have you noticed that both the sun and the moon shows at the same time? Yeah, that's, uh, <laughs> that's a strange thing. Oh, I just love... Simon, look at how, yeah, light is just like standing down there looking at us. Yeah, we can't sleep. I don't know why I got these beds. If we can't it's sleep. Not, not wait, wait, me, what? Me and Jens had our spawn set here. God damn it. 
But you can't sleep. But we did. What is this sorcery? You, you just have to is have it, a sorcery. It face. seems to be day pretty much at the moment. Yeah, that's because I just turned it to day. Because I thought maybe it might uh, be that for whatever reason the time's inverted. By the way, this is a skeleton over near our biodome. Anyone got a sword?